Hey, it's EJ Bobo 3, and let's begin. What's going on, Retro Boy? EJ Bobo 3, and welcome back to Dead Rising. Last we left off, we paid two of my favorite bosses in the game a visit. We, we went to see Adam the Clown, and we stole his chainsaw right from his hands. Definitely not from him cutting himself open. They just took it from his hands. It was fun. And we also paid our good manager, Steven, a visit after our friend Brad got shot in the lake. He got pop skied by Carlito, and we had to go give him some medicine, which we did. Now, everything right now is a little bit messed up. We got uh, Grandpa Barnaby in here sleeping in the supply closet. Jesse's looking scared. Brad's out for the count. And Otis is just kind of chilling. Otis is minding his own business, which I love. Can't believe the manager went off the deep end like that. Freaky. That's what I'm saying, Otis. Uh, our next case begins in roughly two in-game hours, so a couple minutes. So we're going to chill out, wait for that case, and then after that case, we're going to pay the Hatchman a visit because that's also my... Next, that's one of my other favorite bosses in the game. He's definitely top three, at least. But anyways, guys, while we're waiting for the next case to start, if you could do me a favor, head down below, drop a like, leave a comment, hit subscribe, hit the bell, all the play buttons down below. Love and appreciate you all so much for all the support. Um, I'm having such a great time with this series, and if you are too, you know what to do. Without further ado, let us hop to that next case. God, look at that burger on the table. That looks delicious. It's almost as good as the RE2 remake burger. Just want to take a pick it up. Pick that low poly shit up and take a bite out of it. All right, we're here. Let's do it. He's stabilized. Yay! He should be fine for now. Yay! Are you all right? No, I'm sad. You have blood on you. Huh? Yeah. I won't worry about that. Oh. Can't really blame her for running from a guy with your looks. <laughs> Fuck you. Professor, if we're going to protect you, we need to know the truth. What happened to Santa Cabasca? Cabasca? Please. Tell me, goddammit. I take it you know what Santa Cabeza is. I'm going to he probably led that shit. What's going, on? What's going on, bro? Keep talking. Let me get this shot. Keep talking. Unbelievable. Fine. I'll just get my information somewhere else. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'm getting my damn picture. Thank you. All right, let's go pay. Uh, let's go pay our friend at Crispin's a visit. This is gonna be a fun boss fight because I really, really love this boss fight. I love like the area that we fight in. He turns Crispin's home saloon to, into a damn bloodbath. Get out of my way! <laughs> Get out of my way! So I think along with this, he has three survivors, which should bump me up. Right now, when we are sitting at level 15, that should bump me up to um, I guess 16, 17. We are getting to an area where um, I am getting, like, big into levels. Oh, this shit. Oh, oh, God. Hold on. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, God. This is free XP. Give me a sec. Hold up. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Don't mind your skull, mind your skull. Otis, why? Why right now? Someone in the home and garden shop. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Otis, please, 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 please. please. Hurry up. Hurry up, 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 hurry up. Alright. I did, I've, I've forgotten about these survivors. Oh, a lot. Can you, can you come on? I don't care. Can you, let's go. Come on, we got shit to do. We got shit to do. Don't get your panties in a bunch. Alright, I need you to come on. They're right by the front door, so this should be easy. Unless they want to go, like, knuckle fight some zombies. This should go relatively smooth. Why are y'all going the long way? Hop out the fountain. Damn, this is not time to follow rules. We got some bad shit going down. Alright. There. I, I got there. Hey, I got hung up on the walls, dude. Shit. Listen, I'm not mad. This is the free XP at, at my fingertips. I'll always like that. Alright, let's get them to the safe house and then we'll head straight to Crispin's. Uh, we'll head straight to the North Plaza. Get the fuck out of my way! Get out of my way! Follow me! Get out of my way! Sweet. All right, three levels, and we got a health. We got a health increase. Good. That'll be perfect because we're going into a boss fight. Yeah. All right, I will see y'all at the North Plaza. Oh God, we're in for we are in for a lot of fun when we get back to Paradise Plaza. Oh, the cult is about to spawn in. That's great. That's gonna be a lot of fun. Dealing with those shits for the rest of the game. Uh, alright. I also have to keep track of, like, what time it is. 
Alright, it just hit 12. We should have plenty of time to get them back. Fingers crossed, man. Alright, we made it. I feel at home already. Now, I remember the name of the game with him is that he runs. And he runs fast as shit. <laughs> so this is gonna be just so much fun. Name it right, soldier! Eat your bubble three, streamer, sir! Fucking idiot, sir! <laughs> Fun fact, voiced by Steven Bloom, a.k.a. Tank Dempsey from Cod Zombies. Another zombie game that's fucking awesome. I'm right. Aren't I? Time for the most fun game of Cat and Mouse ever. Alright, Clip. Holy shit! Okay. Again? Jesus Christ, Cl Cliff Clifford. Okay. Gotcha, stupid. Uh, all right. Damn it, I was hoping to get another swipe on him. I don't need any juice yet, thankfully. Is he up? There he is. All right. Damn, dude, stop! Sip my juice. Oh, come on. One more. One more. One more. Oh, I thought I got him. Oh, damn it. I thought I got him. One more swipe. He should be dead. Got him. Whoo! I knew there was only one more shot. RIP, man. Saddest cutscene in the game. This. He looks the tiniest bit like Michael Rooker. I just realized that. My granddaughter. Not for me. I feel so bad for this dude, man. He he actually just had a bad psychotic break after losing his family. That's so fucked up, dude. I'm sure a good amount of people would do that in a zombie apocalypse. Also, I don't remember this like really like. Ellie Noir as jazz piece for him. That's nice. <laughs> R.I.P. Cliff. Alright. Oh, fuck. I didn't level up. Thanks for the machete, fucko. Hey, you didn't grab me. Okay, good. Whee! I need y'all to come on. Yes. Y'all need to come on. Oh, thank God. Come on, ladies and gentlemen. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. We got we got a mall to traverse. Now, when, you, when you're when you escorting, I forgot that they respawn. Shit. All right. Y'all, we, we got to stick to the walls. Come on. Come on. Okay, they're all together. I, I didn't know where they were. When you're escorting, like, three, three or more survivors, it gets hectic. When they don't know where the hell they're going, stick to stick to the walls. Stick to the walls. I hope they're still behind me. I'm I'm barely looking. All right. All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. So I should be able to get rid of these focus. Grab the the hungry fucker. So we should be good. Coldest cutscenes is the one I haven't seen in a minute either. Behold! I remember that part. <laughs> Does anyone know where I can buy one of those masks? Because I really want one of the the cult masks. Those little goblin shits are so good. Also, Dead Rising developers, I know you watch my videos. Let us wear the cultist outfit as an outfit in the Dead Rising remake. Remaster, please, I need it. I want the raincoat. I want the raincoat. Also, this is like one of the only times in this game that we get a cutscene of the boss. and But we don't fight him right away. Because we fight old dude like later on in the story. Oh, that fucking face. <laughs> Jesus. In our midst. How do you know I'm a non-believer? I could have been down for the cause. The blood of the heretic. You don't even know me. How do you know I'm a heretic? How can you just say that? Eh, anyway, whatever. Y'all, here. 
I gotta cut the grass real quick. Got a bunch of spoiled dandelions in our midst. There we go. There we go. You get of her? Get up. Hello, Ronald. I have orange juice. Here, here. Take, take it. Come, take it. Take it. Take the juice. Fantastic. Thank you, Ronnie. Another level up. Oh my God. We're just rolling in XP. Come on. Please, the dialogue's looping in my ears. Come on. Come on. Come on. All right. Party of five. This this is gonna push me to level twenty, which is going to be insane if it does. Where's Ronald? All right. Okay, we got plenty of time, and there's only zombies on half the map. Oh, glorious! Coming through. Ow. Ow. Rich, get off the floor. Get off of the floor. This is not the time to cry. Ronald, I am so sorry. <sighs> Jennifer. Oh, good lord. I'm going to die trying to save these dumb fucks. Jennifer, I, 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 I want it to be known right now. I will kill you. <laughs> I don't care. Okay, we gotta go, 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 we gotta go. Please tell me I was in distance. Are all of you here? Alright. Uh. Pro tip, never escort more than five fucking survivors. This shit is hell. I'm also just making sure they all die. I wanna make sure all the zombies are dead, so they can't get caught on anything. Please save all mental breakdowns for when we get to the actual safe house. You can have your panic attacks then, but right now, shut the fuck up and run. Get out of my way! My neck! Alright, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Alright, all of you. All of you. In here. Can all of you guys climb a ledge? Is that possible? I'm happy I was able to get him back, because Rich was, a, was fully about to die. Fun, fun, fun. Come on. Come on. Holy shit. Okay, that's two. See what I, you see what I have to deal with? You see what being the main character is? You see the bullshit of being the main character? I hate it. Okay. Good. Three. Four. And that's five. Good, good, goodness gracious. Oh. Oh. Perfect, level twenty. That's all I needed. Okay, that was a that was a shit ton of fun and a lot of stress. But we got a ton of hey, a lot of survivors we got. We're looking good. We're looking fantastic, and we made it with plenty of time to spare. All right, I'm going to save, and then we will cut back as soon as the next case starts. Cause I think we are going to fight. I think we have one more fight in the next case, so I will see you all. When that shit starts. Alright, we're live. Next case. What we got? It is the Isabella fight. Alright. This fight's gonna suck. I never liked this fight. Because I, as, as a kid, I was a dumb kid. I just got ran over a, a shit ton by her. And I didn't know that she had to stop. Alright, Isabella. Coming for you. God, the title of this mission girl hunting that is insane <laughs> that is a crazy ass title <laughs> all right <sighs> gotta put the kibosh on isabella and her antics i also need more oranges i gave mine my, my last bottle to that big motherfucker ronald of course my my pokey friends are here don't throw your powder at me damn it gentlemen how we doing i just need some juice i just i need juice 
This doesn't have to be anything. I just, I just want to give him a juice, and I'm out of here. I'm out of here, I promise. Alright. See you guys later. I'm, um, heading out. Actually, fuck, I have to kill them. Hold on. I like probably heal with the unlimited orange juice. Well, get off me. Get off me. Blow up on your own time, not on me. Yep, there, there, there it goes. Wow, pies are only one chunk of health? I thought they were... If you eat a whole pie, you would be a lot more healed than just one chunk. Good lord. Alright, I'm here. Isabella, I'm coming for you. Really hoping this boss fight goes smooth and she doesn't just, like, soft lock me into a corner with her bike. I really... I'm hoping. Alright, Isabella. You want to tussle? Let's tussle. Jesus. She does not stop. Holy shit. Ow. Alright. Okay. Wow, that's a full break every time, huh? Sip, sip, sip. Now look at her go. Alright. Good fight, Isabella. I'm glad, I'm glad my chainsaw to her neck didn't kill her. Hey! My dick! Why does everyone go for the dick? Zombies included. Listen to me, I'm not here to hurt you. I just want to talk. Now what do you know about all this anyway? Are you... God, that open mouth scream. What do you know about this anyway? <laughs> what do you know about this anyway? <laughs> I'll bring him to you once he's recovered. Epic. Awesome. I Thank you. Persuade him. I'm his little sister after all. Bum bum bum. Twist. Why should I trust you to bring him to me? Wait for us in the store next to the camera shop in the North Plaza. All right. It's a date. I'll see you then. <laughs> all right. Okay. That zombie. Almost fell on top of me. Alright, pretty good fight from Isabella. Alright, so we gotta be back here in... Ooh, seven in-game hours. More than enough time to save these people. Fingers actually crossed. Because this shit's about to be annoying. So I gotta save those two... I think those two survivors are hanging off the stuffed rabbit on the other side. So I gotta save them. Go back, fight Joe, save... The, the women she has tied up and then somehow somehow managed to get them all back to the safe house With in this game I don't know how I'm going to do that I genuinely don't know this is going to suck so bad but if I'm thinking of, I'm literally just I'm thinking with my experience bar <laughs> because if I if I make if I can manage to make this work that's not that's not a huge level increase we've already gone up five levels this playthrough. There you go. I take it back. We've, went, we've gone up six levels. Didn't mean to drink that. Did not mean to drink that shit at all. Alright. Come on, come on, come on. Alright. Joe... Is going to be... This should be a pretty quick and simple boss fight. Getting the survivors back is going to be harder than the boss fight. You guys have a year. Like you lured another man in here, you little whore. Damn. No. Let's see just how shameless you are, you dirty little skank. What's Say going on? Hello to my little friend. Uh, no, not again. How Lady, where's that nice dick been? I, I got I, I, I got questions. I don't know if I want to know the answer. Jesus Christ! Can I talk to you for a minute? What an evil fucking bitch, man! <laughs> Look, what did that woman do? This seems a little like shut your pie hole. She all she did was take a pack of gum. If you try to get I don't think here, that's worthy of the death sentence. <laughs> <laughs> all right. 
I remembered my luck with Adam. We're gonna... I get... Fuck. Ah, my... My dick! Why is everyone going for my dick? Jesus. I've also never seen that animation before. There we go. Alright. Literally every enemy that is in this game has hit me in my dick. I don't know why that's going like that. The agony! Yeah, you are. And the world will be a better place. Shield your eyes, children! Ah, oh, Joe the cop. First she was coming, then she was going. Burning hell, you nasty motherfucker. Come on. Alright. Yes, Otis. Children, I don't care. 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 Where are the other... Thanks. Hey! Weren't there supposed to be other? I I thought there was other survive... Whatever. Honestly, three, uh, S1 and 3 is a whole lot easier than the other. I thought there was supposed to be more in here. I guess not. Alright, let's just get them back in one piece and we'll call it there. That's the weirdest thing. Did I... How? How are there so many? <laughs> okay, so we have our next, like, group of missions for the next part. Because all that shit is going to be in the Edge Plaza, which thankfully is now right next to Paradise. With the shutter, with the shutter thing. I'm so confused because I, I know K is I know that girl K is there, but I thought there was like like three or four more other survivors in that area with Joe. Unless I got to it too late, but that bar was pretty full and blue when I went over there. I'm legit just killing every zombie that can even be in the vicinity of my survivors. All right, guys, about a hundred feet till you guys are safe. Uh, just Follow me. work with me. Is this is this a lot easier than uh, the other part? Yes. Then I thought it was going to be. Is this a lot easier than I thought it was going to be? Yes. Is the XP going to be as good from it? No. But I am I'm gonna go to sleep tonight with less of a headache, so that's always good. Again, why, why, why my genitals? What is the reason? Oh, all right. Thank you, I try. All right. Cutscene. Forgot, didn't think it was gonna be a cutscene. Hey, Brad's up and moving. You learn anything new on this end? That somebody spread a bunch of zombie drugs around Willamette? That's what it sounds like. For what? What would making the dead come to life accomplish? Revenge! They're terrorists. <laughs> You're looking a little shaky there, man. You good? I've... I've told you everything I know. Now get me out of here! Okay. <coughs> Call for help and kill those creeps! Yeah, that's definitely someone who's gonna make it to the end of this game. He's not gonna die in any horrific way. Yeah, that's gonna be a lot of fun. Did we have an idea there, Frank? Why are we... Why are we doing the finger wag? Alright, cool. Okay. 120,000 XP. That that didn't feel like it. Yeah. Look at one level. Well, we leveled up almost 10 times in this in, in this session. Holy shit. Alrighty. Well, anyway, guys, that is going to be it. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Things are heating up. Barnaby's locked himself in the closet again. Isabella's gonna be on our side. We gotta meet her. And then next part, we have a whole gaggle of survivors to take care of Just leave it to me. in the entrance plaza which hopefully should go well hopefully we can do that and make it to isabella in time but anyways that's gonna be it for me guys love y'all so much you guys are amazing guys are beautiful guys are wonderful guys are fantastic and i will see you all in the next video Just bye